Hello and welcome to one more video of Box Info. Today I am going to show you the pros and cons of Lenovo IdeaPad S540. Let me start the device. Booting time is very fast, all thanks to the SSD. Let me increase the brightness. Let me start with the software what we are getting in the laptop. Lenovo is not blasting us with the tons of unwanted software or apps which I really appreciate. We do get McCafe antivirus here which is just for the one month which means I need to buy a new antivirus here. I got Microsoft Office pre-installed on this laptop for the lifetime. All thanks to the Lenovo. We do have Skype here if you still using it. So let me just open the MS Office Word and show you the speed of the application. And here we have uh, Excel. Ok now the storage, here we have a Samsung SSD and a Western Digital Mechanical Hard Drive, 256GB of SSD, 1TB of a hard drive. These are the specification of the device. I already have done the unboxing of this laptop. If you want I will leave a link in the description. Do watch it. Here we have some quick settings like security, camera privacy, microphone, battery performance. This is an application from Lenovo to monitor your laptop hardware like battery temperature, voltage, hard drive and RAM performance. I'm getting around 4 to 5 hours of battery backup but it all depends on your usage. Here I attached my 2TB of external hard drive to see the copying speed in this laptop. I'm getting around 40 to 60 MB per second on the hard drive. and around 50 to 90 MB per second on the SSD which are very good speed I see. Deleting speeds are around 10 GB per second which is very fast. We do get a Dolby audio system on this laptop. So let me just take my microphone towards the speakers so you will get the better idea what kind of a speaker we are getting on this laptop.
So let's talk about the keyboard here. We do get a backlit keyboard here. I have a very uh, well lit studio here. So let me just turn off some lights and show you the exact light what we are getting on this keyboard. To turn on the backlight, you just need to hold the control and the space key together. And the same goes to turn off. It's not the brightest which I have seen, but also it's not the worst what I have seen. So far I am very impressed with the fingerprint reader here. If you like this info, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Until then, Jai Hind.